In this video, I want to show you how to automate the Chrome browser with a script. This is especially useful for performing small repetitive tasks. In this example I will use it to automatically like and comment on Instagram, with blacklist and whitelist filters, random list comments and random intervals to make it look like normal user activity. You can download the complete ready-to-use script from the URL in the description, but you have to edit the account list and comment list if you want to enable user filters and auto comments. But you should watch this video until the end so you can understand how it works. Welcome to Newbie Computers channel. The first thing to do is find the element of each post, select a post and right click to inspect the element. We will get the tag name of the element for the search process. You see the tag name for the post element has been found, now we will try to find the like button of the post, before doing that, we have to find the parent element where the button is located. Now we are going to test the button to make sure it's the button we are looking for.
we will look for an element for the comment box along with the post button for the comment. We will try to fill in the comment box to make sure the element is the element we are looking for. Next, we should be looking for the post button for the comment box we've found. If we want to choose who we will like, we can create a whitelist or blacklist for filter users. For that we need to find out whose post belongs to. We test whether the element is really what we need. Once all the elements we need are defined, we can string all those actions together in a script for a Chrome extension. I have made it complete and ready to use, you just need to download it. After you download, extract the file and open the accounts.js file to activate the whitelist or blacklist option. Variable like mode can be filled with values 0, 1 or 2, where 0 indicates there are no filters, all accounts will be processed, 1 indicates the script will only process accounts that are on the whitelist and 2 states that it will process all accounts except those on the blacklist. If you want to enable auto comments, open the comments.js file, and set the auto comment value to 1, you can add as many comments to the list as you want, the comments will be randomly selected.
Now we need to load the extension. Go to Chrome extensions in your browser. Ensure that the developer mode checkbox in the top right hand. Click load unpacked extension to pop up a file selection dialog and select your directory. If the extension is valid, it'll be loaded up and active right away. Ensure that the enabled box next to your Chrome extension is checked. Now go to Instagram page, make sure you're logged in. Reload the page to make sure the extension is loaded properly. Min is the minimal interval in seconds. Max is the maximal interval in seconds. Limit is the max light count to light. If we reached this number, the action will be stopped. Click start button, reload the page if nothing happened. The script will start working according to a predetermined random interval. <laughs>